Come on in with your hood girl. Come on in. Come on in. Come on in with your hood girl. Come on in. Come on in. Come on in with your hood girl. Hey y'all. Hey y'all. How y'all doing? Y'all ready for the movie? Let's roll the credits. Hey, hustlers, how y'all doing? Come on in, bring your Kool-Aid, your cocktail, your water, bring your food and snacks. Let's sit and chat with me, this hood girl, to the hood. Y'all, y'all see what we're eating? Mm-hmm. I want to lower this camera a little bit. Okay, there you go. All right, y'all. Uh, let's say prayers. Um, then we're going to tell us, we're going to do what we do, okay? Oh, cool, let's do a silent prayer today, y'all. Bow your heads. And amen. Y'all, I had to get a new bottle of water. Uh, Cause it's just a little here, but we're gonna toast with the little, y'all. It's the last day of the weekend. Uh, let's pray for new days coming and have good fun today, cause today is all you have. So, salute, salute. Let's sip, sip this good water. Cheers. Somebody moving something or something in that hallway. Y'all, we got some Getty. We got some meat sauce with some sausages in it. We got some fresh corn. And I wanted some cornbread, but I ain't have no milk. And I was not going to go to the store today. So I had some rolls in the freezer. So, y'all, you know, we need this uh, Louisiana hot sauce. And I'm hungry, y'all. I am starving today. I had some fun last night. All by myself. When you're happy, you just have fun. You don't need a crowd. Where's that fork, y'all? Y'all want something I know? Mm-hmm. I got some videos I need to do, y'all, to uh, load. I'm bad. Here you go. Yum, yum. Give me some. It's hot, y'all. How's y'all Sunday going? What are y'all cooking today? Thank y'all for supporting me every single day. Thank you. Mmm. 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 That's bomb. Spaghetti is good. When y'all do y'all pasta and sauce, do y'all do it separately? Like you, you, your pasta and then you, you pour the sauce on top or do you mix it all together? Comment below. When we were children, uh, my mother used to put everything in the same pot and was somebody loud and mix it all together. But when I was cooking at the uh, college, they had it separate. So that's how I learned to do mine separately for many, many, many years. And I like thick sauce. Mm hmm. That's so good. Mm. That one's some corn. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna just bit. Y'all, y'all know. Y'all already know my bread situation. But today I was just wanting some bread. This is a yeast bread. And it's so buttery. Mm. 
Oh, y'all remember uh, a couple of weeks ago, um, I told your mother had made a potato salad sandwich. You know, I, I love uh, a spaghetti sandwich, y'all. Mm. This time, I always forget. I just wish this ca this camera here had a timer. And I don't want to give it up because I like it. Or remote or something. We can just shut it off. Mm-hmm. This a, a road is good. Mm. I was thinking about uh, putting some cheese on my pasta too. I was looking at Island Vibe. I think that's her name. I can't remember her name. She did some baked spaghetti. My goodness, it looked good. I'm so hungry. I don't know why I'm so hungry. I ain't had no breakfast, but I had uh, four flats of chicken wings left over from uh, yesterday. But that's all I had. That's probably why I'm so hungry. Mmm. Last night, uh, my show came on. I thought it was over. Uh, what's the name of it? Wait, y'all. Uh, that Atlanta show. Oh, God. Uh, let me eat. Dang, what's the name? It's out, it's out of Atlanta on own. Oh shoot. I I I I have to uh Yeah, I have to. I have to find it. Shoot. I'll tell y'all, give me one moment. Love and Marriage Huntsville. That's it. It it, uh, it came it came on uh, yesterday, y'all. The first show. Melody Hope. She is blossoming. Tisha. Tisha is nerve wracking. She whiny. She won't. She won't too much attention. Mm. That may be a, a baby secret for Tisha's husband. I don't trust him anyway. You know, me and somebody was talking yesterday. I think it was me and D. And me and my sister had the same conversation. Why cheat on your spouses? If you're bored, if the love is gone, move on. Don't bring it to your house. Goodness, that's foolish. It's selfish. I'm not hot. I'm not good. I'm not even putting no butter on it. Mmm. Mmm. That's so good. Stop walking outside of your marriage. If you're done with it, move on.
I knew I was gonna do that, y'all. Y'all saw that, right? I think that one fell on the floor. I just don't like cheating. Cheating, drugs, alcoholism, it just tears your family down. It breaks breaks it up. But we don't stick on cheating. Stop cheating. Yeah. Another thing. A man can go outside of his house. And he can cheat and cheat and cheat. But if his wife do it, he can't stand it. That's when he'll leave. Y'all, y'all. I don't understand it. You know, I, I do want to be in a relationship. I can't, I can't uh, bring everybody else stuff into something that that I may have in the future with a, with a relationship. But one thing my man gonna know is this from the start. If I have to worry about what you're doing when you're not with me, I don't want you. And I don't want you to want me either. Okay? And then if we're living together, if we're married, if you do something with a woman outside of our dwelling, don't come back if you don't want a toe tag. Okay? I'm a, I'm, that's, I, that's period. <laughs> It ain't worth it. Don't give me nothing I don't ask for. There's too many crazy things happening today for people who do that. What if you met somebody outside of your marriage? And they fall in love with you. And then there's a chance that you're going to have to stop sleeping with them because you found somebody else to sleep with. I know uh, I got the guilt trip and you got to now fix your marriage. What if those people, are they turn crazy and lose their mind and come and shoot up your house? Kill you, kill your wife, kill your children. Is it worth that for a piece of tail? A tidy whacker? Is it worth it? Y'all better evaluate these folks if you're going to cheat. Y'all going to meet a monster. We're going to kill your ass or your wife or something. Stalk your house, your job. It ain't worth it. It's just not worth it anymore. Then there's diseases out here. If, you, if you're not smart enough to, to, to coach yourself up before you stick it in her, shame on you. And you got a wife at home. Um, women, if you have a husband at home. Some things are just not worth it. Life is too short. If you got to bring that bull crap into a relationship with me, don't come. At all. I won't miss anything. Trust that. Mm-hmm. That's bomb. Hmm. 
y'all. But for real though, you have this one life to live. Stay happy. Be happy. Don't stay in a broken marriage. I know the vows are the vows. But some people have married for wrong reasons. That's why you're going through your, your, your troubles. But I've been praying for broken marriages for years. Broken children for years. You know? New relationships. I pray about it. Daily. Mm-hmm. I mean... Every relationship is going to go through something. If you're growing. But some people. Really married for wrong reasons. And now their relationship is topsy-turvy. And that's as nice as I can put it. So. If the love Jones is gone, move around. Shut that door before you open up another one. And the other door may even not even manifest because you did it wrong. And that's just something you needed temporarily. Because she was feeling some type of way. Suck it up, buttercup. Mm -hmm. Fix your shit if it's fixable. Fix it. Go to counseling. Communicate. And stop letting your emotions change your decisions. Yeah, I said something now. Uh -huh. Think about it. Don't need to say it again. Stop letting your emotions change your decision. Men and women. Oh, y'all, my drink that night was good. I, I made it uh, different. If y'all on my uh, Instagram page or Facebook, y'all saw uh, with my vodka. I did pineapple juice this time, and um, the the uh, cranberry with black cherry uh, cran uh, juice. I just I just did a little bit of that, and then I have a, a fresh bag of uh, of a uh, cherry. Oh, excuse me, y'all. Cherries in the refrigerator. So I put them uh, cherries in there too, honey. After that drink was gone, them cherries was delicious. Okay, excuse me. Oh, excuse me. Mm hmm. That was really good. Y'all know my evil brother, the one that I'm not very fond of. He got his wife put in jail yesterday. They just fight and fight and fight. Oh, that's that. See what I'm saying? What good is it to stay together when you don't like each other? You know, there's a thin line between love and hate. And if, if you over the love and you going to the hate, 
pack your rags and go. It ain't worth it. It's just not worth it. Mm-mm. Y'all know I'm gonna cuss, right? <laughs> mm. Yeah. It ain't worth it. Yeah, y'all already know how I feel about it if a man put his hands on me, right? Mm hmm Even if he look like he wanna put his hands on me. Hmm. You better have his death policy. Mm-mm. Well, did I say death policy? I mean burial. <laughs> that means I'm serious. All that hitting on each other and shit, that's... Man, get on with that. It ain't even worth it, y'all. And y'all know that, right? First of all, men and women, when you learn to love yourself, you don't take shit from nobody else. Peace by yourself is priceless. Seek it. Get it. It's good. Shoot. Ask me. <laughs> Ask me. Anything. I'll tell you how to do it. It's not easy. But any, everything you do, anything you do is not easy if it's to fight to get your right self in the right place in your right mind. Okay. Oh, Lord, I'll tell you I'm saying something. I don't even know that was going to come out right there. That was almost like rhythmatic. Did I say, did I make up that word? <laughs> come on, y'all, let's sing. Y'all ready, choir? Come on. We really been practicing every day. We're getting a little better. I think I'm finding my undertone voice, y'all. So I'm going to do that one today. Y'all ready? Let's sing. It's time to say goodbye for now. We have another chance around on the other side. <laughs> Whatever y'all do for the rest of this Sunday, beautiful people, do it good, do it with purpose, and do it with what? Genuine love. Don't forget to like your girl. If y'all stay to the end, thumbs your hood girl up. Mm, love you, y'all. And that's nothing you can do about it. Bye-bye.